Hi, I'm David Hartman. The Europeans who first settled our country came here to create new lives for themselves. To do that, they needed land, and land here seemed endless. But by the late 1800s, our vast wilderness was quickly disappearing. Well, then a new notion evolved, that we shouldn't use up nature, harvest it all, that nature has value beyond dollars and cents. Well, since then, the battle over the environment has often been called nature versus progress. But it can't just be nature or progress, either or. We need both. Saving the American wilderness, what we call conservation, it didn't start as a mass movement. It grew from the passion of a few everyday men and women who became giants. The father of the conservation movement, John Muir. An irrepressible widow from New York, Rosalie Edge, who saved our only northern rainforest. Outdoorsman, scientist, but above all, poet, Aldo Leopold, the Thoreau of the 20th century. The extraordinary hiker, he preserved American wilderness, Bob Marshall, who died too young at 38. And the first environmentalist, Rachel Carson, who showed us that our lives were at stake. We've heard about the heroic men and women who pioneered our country and built towns and fortunes. This is the story of the heroes of conservation. They spent their lives saving the land.